All right, let's go ahead and divide these. So we have some exponent rules we've got to take into account. We've got the A's, the B's, and then we've just got the C right here. So let's look at uh, negative 2.38 divided by the 6.8 right there. And again, let's change these into whole numbers. So we got a negative 238 divided by 680. And let's see what that gives us. I mean, you could simplify that at that point. We know it's going to be negative. So 238. We're going to need a decimal there. Divided by 680. Because it won't go into 238. So let's look at some multiples of 680 then. All right, there's some multiples. Let's see how far that gets us, though. So 2380. Looks like it will go into it three times which would give us 2040 and when we subtract we get 340 oh that's nice so when I drop the next zero it's 3400 which is right here one two three four five and it looks like our answer is right here that's just for the number part of this problem though right so that's just this part negative 0 0.35 we do need that though so what about the A's? If we look at the A's, we've got A times A times A times A divided by A. And when we cancel these out, we have three more A's. So that would give us A cubed. The B's right here cancel out, so they're gone. And we just got have that C left over. There's our answer.